What's up, everybody? Sparrow with a gun here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Elite Dangerous. Uh, when we left off, we had basically stripped the Sidewinder down and turned it into a cargo hauler, which was an awesome idea, uh, because we have been making a good amount of money. Now, I did do some flights off-screen, because they were kind of boring, and, well, boring is not fun. I'm currently sitting on about 6,000, however, we have four tantalum in our cargo hold, ready to go to... Acellus Primus, aka Beagle 2. So, my plan here is I had about 20 grand in my Engine credits, engaged. and I know for a fact, because I just checked when I logged in today, that um, the hauler costs about 23, 5 ish. Ooh, that was fun. Um, the hauler costs about like 23, 25,000, somewhere in that window. I can't remember exactly what. I think it's somewhere closer to 23 um, at Word, because that's where I logged off at. So I know that it's there, and that's how much it costs, or roughly. So I'm going to take one run t of Tantalum to Beagle 2, which should get me to about 23 grand. And then I'm going to buy some terrain enrichment systems and take them back to Word, and that should put me at about 27-ish, 26, something like that. Um, which should be enough to buy our hauler, and then we can go do stuff. Um, so we'll see how that works. I may do a run in between there. I'm not positive yet, just to make a little bit more buffer. Um, but we'll see how that goes along the way. So I will be back when we're at Beagle. Alright, so we have arrived here at Beagle 2. I already refueled the ship. Now it's time to sell our stuff. Um, I did find... I was derping around on Slopies. Uh, the the uh, profit calculator, which is amazing. Uh, I, live with, I live with that thing. It's amazing. Um, and I thought to myself, I don't think I can make the jump right from here to Word. I don't think it's that uh, close, so I would have to do multiple jumps anyway, so why not buy what I need to go to the jumps? I realize that these, I have to pay nine grand for them, but I get a four grand profit from them at Dahan, which is kind of a pit stop along the way. Um, so we're going to go ahead and buy these. Let's check a bulletin board now that I've filled up my cargo hold. No, no, focus, focus, focus. Holler, 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 holler. Focus. Okay. <laughs> so we can make it to Dahan from here. It's not that far. So we already refueled. We already loaded up. So let's head on out. Um, and then... I don't know if I can make it from... Oh, we're getting better at that. Uh, I don't know if we can make it from Dahan to Word in one jump. Uh, we'll have to see when we get there. I don't think we... I think I have to go to Morgor and then I can jump from there, I think. Uh, so I will meet you all there and we will see what happens. Alright, so here we are at Dahan again. Now, I was... I like to use Slopey's uh, profit calculator when I'm flying, because flying can be kind of boring. To see, like, where I'm going... Wow, at the glitching. Um, to see where I'm going after I leave, basically, from wherever I'm heading. So I looked up Morgor, and it, the most I can do right now is a 700 credit profit, which isn't terrible, but I think I can make the jump from here in like two jumps, like just skip it. I could just skip Morgor altogether, I think. Um, so I don't even think I'm going to bother. Well, I don't even think I need to waste the time. 4,000 credit profit! Bam! Almost 30 grand, which is amazing. Um, unless there's anything headed there. No. Alright. So, let's just double check our... We're gonna go ahead and lock this in, but let me check the galaxy map. 
Uh, to double check, so from more gore, yeah, I think I can. I think I can get to word in one jump, even if I can't. I should be able. Well, either way, uh, I will see you all at my next destination, which will most likely be word. It might be here. I don't know. We'll find out. I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> so funny story. Um. <laughs> All right. I gotta walk you guys through this because. Well, actually, let me wait till my HUD comes back up. This is funny. Okay, so somehow I ended up in Azaban and not in um. Oh. What? Oh, it's because I did the stock. Okay, I did the stock ship. Now, wait a minute. Can I buy it from here? No. They don't have a hauler. Dang. Alright, let's get rid of these. Um, because they're just added weight and I can fly farther without them. And it's not like they're going to give me any money. Be gone. Okay. So, funny story. I go to leave from the Han, right? Excuse me. And I'm in this mode where I'm looking around. I go over to make sure that... Wow, I can make it to Morgor from here in one jump? No way. Whoa. That's pretty epic. Um, so I was like making sure this is locked in out of habit from all the console games that I play. I hit circle to back out of this menu instead of just looking away. Circle is my turbo button. I had already launched my ship. It did not end well. Um, so basically I got right... Uh, wait for it. Wait for it. I got right here, I start to fly away, and I'm like, did I lock in what I need? I check, I hit circle. Oh, this says insufficient fuel, so let's jump to the hunt. Um, I hit circle, boom, just turboed right towards the wall. I did braking, reversing everything, just slammed right into the wall, and completely pancaked myself, and just died on impact. Like, the, uh, the onboard computer didn't even have time to say anything. It was like, shields, and we're dead. So, luckily, we're still flying the stock, um, Sidewinder, so it didn't cost me anything to repair the ship or anything like that. So we still have the money to get a hauler. Unfortunately, we are going to have to jump to Dahan and then over to... Uh, we might have to land and refuel, unfortunately. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Minor hiccup, but hilarious one. So I will, um, I will come back when we have made our way to Word, because I've checked my routes along the way, and they're not really that profitable to take make any stops. Oh, I should have checked. Oh, well. I'll be back in a minute. Alright, so we are here back at Word. Um, side note, love this station. This station is just like my favorite one. Um, and we made it in in one fuel tank. I went from Irinen, um, also known as Azaban City, let's stop, um, to here in one tank. Like, we uh, jumped and made multiple and multiple jumps. I think I went from... Irinen to Dahan, from Dahan to Morgor, Morgor to B, D, something or other, and then to here. So we did like four jumps, which I guess the jumps aren't the big deal, it's the distance that you travel. So taking, if you're planning on hauling with the Sidewinder to start, uh, taking... Oh, I can't read the numbers in this place. That's the only, only thing I don't like about them. There's 13. I'm probably looking right at it, but I just can't see these numbers. 13, there you are. Wow, nothing like putting it right inside the door for me. Thanks, guys. 
So I feel like I'm going to be cheap and not even refuel my ship. I'm just going to sell it without a full tank of gas. That would be kind of funny if they implemented it like real cars, where it was like you had to fill it up or something. Or pay to have it filled. <laughs> that would be kind of funny. That was a little fast. Okay. Star Wars are... Here we go. Here we go, guys. This is happening. Oh my gosh! Now watch, the price will have gone up in like the past five seconds. Holler! For 23000 I think so. I can spare that pocket change. Because I have so much money. Please stand by. I'm standing by. Alright, so I know this process can take a minute, so I think I'm going to pause it while it loads. And right when I pause it, it gets done loading. Oh my gosh, look at our ship. Holy guacamole! It actually looks like a truck. Like we've, like we got like the overhead lights and and everything. Oh my gosh, it's got that new car smell. I love it. But I miss my Christmas tree. Why is the Sidewinder the only ship with a Christmas tree? That kind of sucks. Honestly, as gorgeous as this game is, whenever I get a new ship like this, I could just sit around and look at the dashboard all day. Like it just looks awesome. Um, somebody, I forget who it was, it may have been Sleepless Nights Films, I'm not, or film, I'm not sure, but somebody sent me a link to a picture of the Anaconda cockpit, and oh my gosh! I was like, I want one! I want one so bad. I don't even know what it does. Alright, so I'm going to take a minute and review our credit that we've got, which is, what do we have left? Five grand. Um, I don't know what the insurance on this is. Oh, 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 no, before we do that, let's check the outfitting to see what we've got on it already. Um, ooh, let's check the bulletin board now that we can actually haul stuff. Make a difference. Eh, we're not a fighter. Long distance transport. Hey, we can do that. Quantity 6, reward 1900. We have a shipment of algae. It's a long haul. This is reflected in the increased rate of pay, which we're sure you'll find amenable. We expect you to take good care of... Well, that's not too great. It's not too great either. I feel like I could probably make my own money better just figuring out my own rates. It's probably because you're not supposed to be using, like, the Slopey's calculator thing, but I don't really feel like that's cheating, in my opinion. Okay, okay, we have one hard point. Oh, look at our little, our little truck. Um, that's what it is. It's the truck of space. Um, utility mount. I don't know what qualifies as utility. I guess it's like the... Um, ooh, maybe we should... That's right. Somebody recommended to basically keep one weapon and then just like buy armor. So we might end up doing that. I'm thinking... Well... I don't know yet. I have I have ideas. So let me um what else is there? Well, yeah, let's get a type six. No, actually I think my next step might be a cobra. I'm thinking. Um so let me double check Slopies, see what it says, and we shall return in a moment. Oh, let's check to see what's available. Okay, we can get the bulg and BD from here. The rest, I guess, is too far away. Um, so yeah, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so according to Slopey's calculator, um, we can carry, or we can afford, I should say, about 13 units of um, fish, which will net us a 7 grand profit at BD 47 or whatever. So, fish is where it's at, apparently. Oh my gosh! Oh, actually, oh, we can carry more than that. That would pretty much max us out, but it's not going that far, so I'm gonna risk it. Oh gosh, we only have 61... Wait, what did that say? It looked like I only had 61% of something. Oh, credits, I thought it was saying hull, and I was like, what? I just got this thing. Alright. 
Oh gosh, I've never flown in one of these before. I'm scared. Ship released. Engines Ooh. engaged. I feel like I wait, no, maybe I don't. I was gonna I was about to say I feel like I have a better field of view. Nope. That's a ceiling, is what that is. Alright. Debris. Is that debris? That's comforting. No, that's a ship. I probably shouldn't be flying fast. Hi, fellow hauler. They are fellow haulers now. What's its top out? 200? That's about like the Sidewinder, I think. I think the Sidewinder's 210 topped out with four blips. It's actually quite nimble. I gotta admit. Alright. Right, all right, all right. First jump, I'm so excited. It's like a new car. Drive charging. Or like a new puppy or something, I don't know. Does it sound any different when it jumps? Probably not. That would be cool though if they all had different sounds. Ready? Wait for it. Three, two, one. Wait for it. Alrighty. So, we are at... Oh, how do I say this? Olivus? Olivus? Settlement? Sure, that's what we're going with. Um, I finally figured out... Oh, and I have to apologize, I don't know if anyone... I don't know how long it's been going like this, but I... Something sounded really quiet and I checked my sound settings, it was down really low. So, if the game sounds, or my mic sounds, or anything like that sounded off... Um, I'm gonna go ahead and apologize for that because it should not have been that way, but it was my bad. Um, let's see what the landing gears do. Probably 150? 100? Ugh. And I, fe I realized what made it feel like a truck. It's the air vents. It really, the, the two little air vents right there make it feel like a car to me, um, which is an awesome touch. I love it. That it has little fans. Okay. Oh, uh, I don't think we're close enough to do a... to do a ping yet. I probably shouldn't have deployed my landing gears, but whatever. Um, let me see if I can boost my way. I did figure that out. That if you turn your assist off, it's like, uh, in Space Engineers, like turning off your inertia dampeners. It's very difficult for me to fly this way, though, because it doesn't autocorrect. But it does let you basically idle at a much higher speed, which is fine. Whoa, 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 whoa! 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 Wasn't me! I didn't do it, I didn't know that guy. Whatever he did, I... I have no... Oh crap! Um, I'm about to do the same thing. Your best one. Oh, thank you. That would have been horrible. Warning. Detecting hostile scan. I don't have anything. It's fish. It's fish. Leave me alone. Oy vey. That was scary, man. Alright. Sorry for the wonky piloting mechanics here. Um, new ship and not the best pilot in the world should not should be all I need to say. <laughs> Not a not an awesome pilot and new new truck ship that I'm not used to. Although I'm no physicist or astro mechanic person or anything like that, but I would think if the thrusters are balanced and everything, they actually should handle the same because you're out in space. There's no frictional resistance or weight really, other than like the resistance that the thrusters have to use. Hence if it's balanced correctly, but I don't know. I could be totally off base on that. Uh, patrol, Patriot seeks fiery companion. What? Needs a combat pilot. Yeah, I'm not a combat pilot right now. I gave up my bounty hunting pirate days. I became a trader and a hauler by trade. I hung up my guns for now. <laughs> Alright, so let's trade in this fish and get rich. 
because this excites me. What is it? A eight grand profit? Boom! Right back up to 13. Oh, I am going to be a very happy hauler. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so I think that's about going to wrap things up for this episode. Kind of the highlight of my day. Um, so in the meantime, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, and I will see you all next time. Peace.